Welcome back to the Electrician's Channel. Tonight I want to talk to you guys about uh, my, my clamp meter. It's the Ampro 54NAV ACDC True RMS uh, clamp meter. Uh, I'm going to tell you guys about how much I like this meter and um, how much I trust this meter and uh, give you, as always, the, my likes and dislikes about the things that I review. This meter is, 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 is well built. It's packed with a lot of features. Um, Ampro is a name that's been around, uh, a company that's been around for quite a while. Um, I never heard anything bad about Ampro. I've heard, uh, um, this is my first time owning an Ampro. I have a multimeter also. And uh, I just, it's, it's a real good product. The Flute Corporation acquired Ampro a couple of years ago and took Ampro under their wing and now uh, uh, Amprobe is a division is a division of flukes the fluke corporation and uh, you can kind of see um, some of the things some of their you know it, uh, it's been upgraded a little bit the Amprobes that I've seen in the past and Amprobes I see today that fluke since uh, fluke has acquired Ampro you can see it's been updated a little bit um, it looks a little different it feels a little different you know, just because I've, I've never owned one before, but I've, you know, had it in my possession for us to use it before. And this feels almost like a fluke. Uh, it's real, it's real, not heavy, but it have some weight to it. Uh, it's, let me turn it on for you. Turn it on for you. That's the backlight. They have this toggle switch. Uh, and it's packed with some of the features. So but let me just tell you some of the features that I know that it's packed with right now. It has temperature. It has, it has a uh, phase sequence. It has a power factor. It has harmonics extortion. Uh, distortion. It has inrush current. Low, low pass filter. AC-DC continuity. Min-max feature. Peak hold. Auto power off feature. It's a, it has a CAT4 rating, 600 volt. Cat 3 rated at 1,000 vote, votes. It has frequency and capacitance. Uh, and it's also rated for a full foot uh, drop. Um, this, this, this meter is, it also has a watts feature. And that's the power factor, but watts. Um, this meter is, 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 is really nice. These are uh, um, is some of the accessories that come with it, except this. This comes off my uh, my multimeter, and I just use it to put this around it like this. So when I want to clamp it, when I'm using it, and I want it to hang on a panel door or what have you, you know, because it don't have the panel, it don't have the the magnet in the back like the client multimeters do, or clamp meters do. But so I just kind of made something, um, made something that it'll hang, you know, up there. Um, so I put some little wire tire, a wire tire in there, sort of do that. That's one of the features that I. That's one of the things that I don't like that it didn't have the magnet that it'll hold this, so I wouldn't have to do such a thing with this. But uh, I could live with that. This is a real good multimeter. But just check out the backlight and just check that out. It's 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 really good. And, and guys. You you won't go wrong if you decide to uh, purchase this this clamp meter. You won't go wrong at all. It takes a nine volt a nine volt uh, battery, um, and it has this work light. This work light on it. This spring clamp is really strong. It has this non contact voltage right here detected, right here, and um, like I said, temperature. Um, they have all these things right here, all these uh, features. It, it's this. It's a. It's a real nice meter. As far as the leads, uh, they're not bad at all. They're kind of stiff. You know, they have some flexibility to it, you know. But I felt better leads than than this. But um, I can live with that. I can live with that. The clamp, uh, the alligator clips. The work I do on the panels, I, I could use this, and I, you know, but I have some larger uh, clamp uh, alligator clips that I use instead of these, 
and but these are the ones that come with it and this case right here this pouch I had to buy this pouch separately because the pouch that came with it didn't have the strap it was just a solid black pouch with a little zip on it no name whatsoever I purchased this pouch because this 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 pouch because it's it's much bigger and it had a lot of room that I could put my extra accessories in here if need be the other pouch didn't have room at all for me to do such a thing but this meter this clamp meter here is really good um, I, you can't go wrong you can't go wrong with it I am well pleased at owning this clamp meter this this ampro I am very pleased at owning this ampro um, if you if, if you guys are looking to purchase a meter uh, and you don't have the fluke money I will go with this ampro I will go with it um, I know there's other meters out there uh, I have several other clamp meters that I own that's real nice but I really think this ampro would do the job for you um, uh, that's all I have for you right now um, I hope that you found this video interesting I found something that I said or, or, or done and you found this video interesting if you like this video just hit the like button if you want to receive uh, notifications of any other videos that I may put out in the near future uh, just subscribe to my channel in the meantime fellas you all stay safe be blessed until the next video peace out